Mackenzie Critiques. It is Mackenzie Critiques. Let's get something straight here. Yeah. It's called Mackenzie Critiques. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Mackenzie critiques to Mackenzie Dick Rides a favorite anime. Welcome to a double live reaction to Madoka Magica episode 2 and episode 3. Puella Magi Madoka Magica Omar Sojo Madoka Magica episode 2 and episode 3. Now, it feels good to be resuming reactions finally. I've been on a, uh, a spree of re uploading my old reactions, and majority of people on YouTube are brain dead lemmings. They've got a very, very short fucking memory, you know. It's not in 15 minutes, like 6 minutes, 7 minute memory or very short memory. Will not realize that fucking I had an old channel. That old channel worked down. I had 2,400 motherfucking subs. And it is a nightmare fucking trying to communicate to people that you've got a new channel. And to come there. People just lapse. People just lapse. They expect to see your reactions in their fucking subscriber feed. And I have fucking close subs who are, who are just so fucking lazy. They just stop being subs. Oh, they'll be like... Uh, uh, they're just fucking just not engaged because they've you know you I've allowed them too much time to be disengaged. But now I've resumed my fucking reactions, make live reactions great again. So we're starting strong or continuing strong with Madoka Magica episode two and three. Drifters live reactions are in my description box below. They won't be linked on my channels at all. I'm telling people my reactions that my weekly Drifters live reactions that will go out with Jojo on the same day, in fact, before, uh, on Daily Motion, will be linked in my description box below. So keep checking my description box. Keep checking my description box. Associate D for description box, D for Drifters. Associate those th things together. Because my playlist for Drifters will only be in my description box for all my latest reactions. Like if you do the first two or three videos. So, without further ado, let's get into this. And The Exorcist Episode 7 just downloaded. Also, what I'll do is if you're expecting a continuation of my uh, one ounce live reactions, they're coming. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend all of today and tomorrow re uploading everything from episode 1 to episode 15 of uh, my one ounce live reactions. Then, once they're all up and everyone's on the same page, I'm going to resume my one ounce reaction. So, don't worry about the fucking one ounce live reactions, they are continuing. I thought, you know what, let's get something new in here. Let's get some fresh fucking blood in here. I rambled on enough. I'm fucking exhausted. I've been ill. I've had chest infection, food poisoning. I'm now fucking in a place where I can continue these reactions. So, people have told me episode 3, around episode 3 is when Madoka and Magica gets good. So, please forgive me. If they're not that good, the first couple of episodes, I will say so. Madoka Magica, episode 2. Come on. That girl was asked, do you want to be a magic girl? I'm done with mommy. The hell can I bombast stay with it? I'm a senior at your school. Cube. Magical girl from the contract, Cube. Ah, yeah, her dreamy. Her lucid dreamy. <laughs> It's a side trap. It's a side little girl. <laughs> Not much of a dream, eh? Oh, hi, oh, my dog. I don't know what to make of this. These, these really aren't the kind of animals I watch. But it was the first time for everything, man. Magic, I can't. You know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to elevate myself from my body right now. I look at myself watching Madoka Magica and it makes no fucking sense. <laughs> but let's see how it goes, man. People are saying it will surprise me. And I'm hoping it will. I'm willing to give it a benefit of the doubt. If it's like a great, great Magic Girl anime, like I'm talking about like profoundly good, then, you know, that will trickle through to me in some form or other. I love Shinsekai Yuri, man. I love Amato and Azuma. I thought they were really good animes. I'm also stuck up that, you know, I, I'll just go, nah, I hate this because of the imagery and all that stuff. But this intro is very, very unlike anime I would watch. 
or who I would in fact promote so Exactamente como lo vamos a hacer. También. It's good though. I'll listen to my uh, portfolio of anime critiques. So people can't say you didn't fucking watch Madoka. Plus, this is getting a butchery anyway, so. <laughs> yeah, she should, man. Good girl can't be fucking going bad now, man. Cube. Cube is not gonna fucking lose his head like fucking fucking Rezero, is it? No one else can see him. She doesn't question it. Is that my life so fucking mundane? Like she doesn't. She doesn't even seem to be responding. She's not shocked. Yeah, usually, it's very anime characters are shocked to be in this position. But maybe you know she expects. Idea. What kind of cake is it? Looks good, man. Chosen by Cube. <laughs> they could have picked any generic fucking anime girl in the school, but they picked her. So, yeah. One way shy about this. Anything you want. Immortality. Chinese, Chinese emperor. Why not Japanese emperor? Chinese cartoons. <laughs> oh wow. So it's it's well, a contract, but you get something out of it. Not just thrust upon it. You get fucking wish out of it. Mama. Oh shit! <laughs> mom is savage, man. Bloody hell! Our mom is fucking career-minded, man. Wow, is that what she thinks about? Sales department. Already my puppets. Ball in the county. <laughs> Her mom is a scary bitch, man. Not gonna lie, man. How did she ever give birth to someone like Madoka? Man? Which is a both of curses. Alright, that makes sense. Actually, this is anime. Nothing makes sense. Which is curse. I guess this is these barriers are behind which they do these battles. That's why these elaborate battles can take place. Uh, Reminds me of sort of Doctor Strange and how he fights. Any wish granted, but you gotta spend your fucking life <laughs> fighting witches, man. You get. Any wish you want out of it, you know? Anyone will take it. On a witch hunt.
whether having your wish come true is worth your life. It depends, man. Like you need to, you need a taster of what it's like to be fine with witches, man. <laughs> it can be a free read of the answers to the exams. Ah, it's like a medium to channel their thoughts so they can communicate. They can cheat at exams and tests, share it like a hive mind. Don't, don't say it. What the? <laughs> anime world problems. Forget first world problems. Anime world problems. You communicate to the eyes, bitch. I'm going to slap you up. You're both girls. All right. Love that can never be. All right. You're getting ahead of yourself. <laughs> God damn, man. This is why we maintain these archetypes in anime, man. <laughs> anime will probably lose its identity if it tried to be, be, be anything else. Oh shit. They really should fucking tea at test man with his power. Speak of the devil <laughs> and she shall arrive. My whole shoulder. She seems quite powerful. She's probably been doing it for a while. Why would she stop the creation? Is it because magical girls become witches? Is it more, more fuel? Oh wow, who gives you this reward? It felt like a contest in the first episode. Bloody hell. <laughs> Can't she hear them as well? They're going to start hearing her voice. Watch. Do these guys even concentrate in class knowing that they got these powers? See, look, if one's falling asleep, they're too busy thinking about their new powers and shit. They're going to fall behind, man. <laughs> what about fucking Subaru? He must be falling, falling behind a class. He's been stuck in another world. <laughs> Escapist fantasy. <laughs> Weird universe. Look at that architecture. The thing about that wish, isn't it? I wish I was immortal to say that. That way you really will be fighting witches for the rest of your life. An immortal witch hunter. 
If it's a dangerous job, wish for immortality. He said, don't. That would be the most obvious, I think. Living such a sheltered life has made us ignorant. <clears throat> this is a bit deep for a magic girl. <laughs> Yeah, why them? Just chance, pure chance. Yep. What do you want? <laughs> the face designs are so weird. Exactly, but it's a competitive thing, isn't it? Yeah, I remember that. What did you make to become a magical? What wish did you make? Well, what she didn't say. Maybe a wish is the very personal thing, man. What wish you'd make to to trade your life away? Uh, that would be a very personal thing, man. I'd imagine. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Come on, man. Shut up, bitch. Look. <laughs> She's a com comedy part of this triplet. Wow. She's all fucking like, uh, like brain dead, like in real life. But as a witch hunter, she's probably like magic girl. She's all fiery, hot headed. What did she buy? A baseball pad. <laughs> <laughs> She's been designing her costume, man. I knew what boys would be like that. They'd be like, you know what, I'm going to design my costume. Like, not to say oh, this is only a female thing. Boys would be scribbling away like Spider Man was designing his costume. They're laughing as well, though. <laughs> I love the exaggeration to it. Damn, so can witches be in the real world as well? I'm sure they can. I know witches uh, work behind barriers, but that does technically doesn't mean that they can't exist in the world like these guys do. Oh shit, yeah, there were news, man. What if the transfer student is, is legit? Uh, they're making a distruster, but mommy son is a witch tricking him. What if mommy is, is not all she says she is? Why is it German written on the walls? Something schlagen. Oh wow, nice. Desolate places are perfect for suicides.
Bloody hell, these witches are fucking affect people in real life, man. Really bad. Like, it's all weak. Must be close. Whoa. Red stilettos. There's some woman's about to commit suicide. Oh shit. Oh, nice. Why was she trying to commit suicide? Oh, she's got a mark on her. Witch's kiss. Ikuayo. Ikuayo. It's an exhort. Music is good. I like the music. Fits it well. What the hell? <laughs> Fuck it, I turned into some. It reminds me of uh, Doctor Strange. Pearls opening, relics, fucking. Uh. At the end of the mirror world or some shit. Oh wow, it's like. Like a dark Alice in Wonderland. What? She just dropped that musket. Wow, I like this imagery. Very artistic. You too scared. Abstract as well. Uh, this is awesome. I'm scared, but this is who you want to be, right? Madoka, this is who you want to be, right? Why are they red high heels? Is that imagery? Oh, shit. I love the use of art, man. They've used, um, what's, the, what's that show? That Monty Python-esque paper cutting type. Well, what the fuck creatures has got? Look, that's a witch. Wow, I was not expecting this. This abstract art style for the, for the witches. Oh wow! Very Alice in Wonderland, but very like a dark, twisted Alice in Wonderland. Oh shit! <laughs> Guns are falling out of the sky like no man! Oh shit! This escalated quickly! Oh fuck! Her minions, man! Oh! Oh! Mami san. Fuck. Well, it's a training for her, yeah? <laughs> Future proteges. What is she doing? Very experimental art design, man. I like it. Animes tend not to do this. I'm watching another very experimental animation style with Kaiba. A ribbon, man. Holy shit. Tiro finale, fuck it now. Giant pistol chamber, man. There's gotta be a video game from Madoka, right? There's gotta be a video game. From Madoka Magic. Visually fucking you know what? Like a treat for the eyes, man. That's <laughs> got cup of tea. Yeah. <laughs> Grief seed, which is it? Tamago. So, what do we use it for?
Oh, nice. Oh, so cool. One more time. It may help him find another fucking uh, witch. If he gets dirty, it becomes harder to find, I guess, other witches. The comp competition here, man. The fucking pride involved. I bet her wish was to fucking be alive forever, man. Live forever. But now she's living forever being this competitive. Anti-social bitch. <laughs> Where's the third mate? The one that thinks that they've got some fucking lesbian relationship. Why is she with them? The third one doesn't know, right? No, no, she knows, she knows. Why was that? She got the witch's kiss on it, fucking. Bad dream. Say I'm be poor in a heart, save us. <laughs> what do you guys? But what's your wish though? We know you're gonna help people. You should hold on to a wish. It would be nice, but what's your wish gonna be, fam? Your wish. <laughs> Alright, let's go. This sounds like fucking this sound Tom do not fucking bullshit me. No it doesn't no it doesn't This sounds like fucking uh, my name is Totoro 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 This fucking sounds like that Shit it's a good song though <laughs> cutesy song Alright Alright Let's go, fucking Madoka Magica episode. That was good. Uh, you know what? That was actually actually good. You know, I like that. I like that episode. This is where shit gets real, allegedly. I'm not going into this. Remember, people, yeah. Like, this is why I call myself Makenshi critiques, not Makenshi Dickras and Ferrari. I don't go in expecting to say that your anime is a masterpiece, like. You recommend it because you fucking love it. You think it's a masterpiece. That doesn't necessarily mean I'll come away from it thinking it's a masterpiece. But if you went to the length of recommending it to me, knowing what I like and what I re respond to, I'll give you the fucking respect of watching it and seeing the merits of it. And, you know, if there's merit there, I will fucking say it. So, you know, I'm, I'm interested. I'm very intrigued to see where this goes, man. Okay. Madoka Magica episode 3. Come on. Interesting, interesting. I need to remember her friends' names. Who's this? Is it my brother? Oh, it was his favorite CD. Dawn of Struck. He likes classical. Rare CDs. Sayaka. Oh, nice. Who is this? Her brother? He's ill. Oh, that's when she was young. She probably remembers. Classical music has that effect, man. What's wrong with him, anyway? Wow, pretty uh, sober, sober fucking opening there. 
Just here. <coughs> Maguka presents Puella Magi Madoka Magica. Puella Magi Madoka Magica. Mahasojo Madoka Magica. Magic Girl Madoka Magic. <laughs> Be very interested to see where this goes. Now, I've heard, I've heard anecdotally that, like, Grease Lightning Reactions gave me this a chance. I once asked the guy, what's your least favorite anime out there? What anime don't you like? And I think he said Madoka Magica. And he goes, I think he said something along the lines of, this is just a casual conversation. I'm sure you won't mind, you won't mind me sharing this and stuff. That it tried too hard. It, like, like it, it, he acknowledges that it tried to do something different for the, for the genre. But it was a try-hard sort of anime. We'll see, though. And I think I'm, I'm kind of approaching it from a perspective where I'm not familiar with uh, Magic Girl anime. So maybe I'll, you know, see some redemptive qualities in it. Shaft. <laughs> Shaft. They're a fucking anima animation studio unto themselves, man. They play by their own rules. <laughs> wow. That gun, man. They don't fit all it. She's just chilling. She she just bust out a fucking huge gun. You expect her to to fucking like a woman would, like fucking scream, fucking a huge gun. Nah, they don't fit all it. <laughs> it's the magic show, you know. I want to see that what that what that she means by dangerous. I like, did like straight up death. What does Cube even do apart from sit there look cute? Once he gives the powers, is that it? Wow, so that's how they multiply. Families break off and become like the witch. Think like does she think selfishly though? That's the thing. She's giving her gonna give her life away to do this. So will she do a selfish wish? Like all about herself or something a bit better. I wish no wishes ex witches existed. Maybe something like that. Why can't they just say, I wish no witches existed? Oh shit. Car crash. Oh, this is her, her backstory. It came to her. She made her. Oh wow, that, that is like the lowest moment to get someone. I wish to live. I guess. If you have the choice, she had no choice. Oh, it's opportunity to her, I didn't care. It's, I guess it's any wish. Ah, she's thinking of her brother. I guess wish, it doesn't matter what wish it is, but when you, you take that wish, you become a magic god. Ah, she's gonna use it for a bro, man. No, that's the that's the weird thing animes do. They over intellectualize it. You don't want your fucking bro to die. Simple as that. Do you want to be the one to save him? Or this, this, this. I'm like, fuck that shit. If you went ahead, well, it is, and you regret it later. It's as simple as wanting your sibling to live. <laughs> simple as that. I'm being a little too naive. Did she just talk her out of that? I wish. That she was thinking. That I knew she was thinking. You shouldn't watch your decision. Yeah. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what conclusion they come to. Girls hate guys who pressure them. Not all girls.
do you just ask for power? No, she wants to help people. <clears throat> but her, she she couldn't be a magic girl if witches never existed. They become redundant, wouldn't they? So she would never wish no witches. You could buy a much more powerful magic girl. Than <laughs> Damn. They are inextricably linked though, especially since Madoka wants to be a magic girl. So like, you wouldn't want to wish for the threat to go away, the witches, because that justifies your existence as a magic girl. The mom is such a fucking strafe, man. Stray. She's worried about Madoka coming in late. The mom's fucking <laughs> coming home drunk. A challenge. this guy too is you're too young to be the her dad <laughs> oh but it's it's the dad I really like that about your mom the mom's a bit old isn't it, for this guy if that's the dad I like that about your mom they don't really establish Madoka's home life, but I'm pretty sure that's her dad. Everyone looks a bit small in this. You're leading them to us. Nuisance. She's fucking shit there from Kaname Madoka. Why? Like, who cares, man? Anyone stronger will get in your way. What, what, what happened to the altruistic part of it about stopping fucking witches? They've been holding back, man, for the sake of these noobs. <laughs> you can tell. It's like you don't want them getting involved. Look, look at her look up. <laughs> she pissed, man. Fired it into that wall. Cell number. Are they officially magic girls yet? They haven't made their wishes yet, have they? We still have time. Yeah, and they they haven't. They're not magic girls yet. Well, no, actually. Her baseball bat transformed into some weird thing. Maybe she can fight with that. They don't be a fucking hero, man. Sure, it's out of the bar barrier, okay. Oh, 
Oh. God, she's all alone in there. Ness. Ness there. Come up with a wish. Operating theatre. Fucking hell, she's not going to survive, man. You you need to fucking... You don't know what's going to happen. Oh, God. calmly as possible. There's no reason for Madoka to go in. Syringes are here. It's surgery themed. Oh God. I trust you. <laughs> oh wow! Tie up with ribbons. She's really obsessed. Uh, mommy son is taking obsessed with taking these girls deep into fucking like you know trial by fire, man. What the fuck are they? They're rats, but mixed with. Pills, man. Pill popping. Excellent place for a witch to exist. Or, or a mini, I mean, a uh, familiar. Without being able to help anyone. Okay, so what's your fucking wish then? <laughs> Strawberry donut. It's like Hazel and Gretel, she's in the house of fucking candy. But the witch has wanted to plump her up, innit? The witch wants them fat, really nice and juicy and fat. Isn't that the case? Now fucking magic girls are, can become witches. Or can become witches. And I think there's something sinister with mommy's side. She's trying to fat her up. You won't have time to fall in love and hang out with friends. I swear to God, if Madoka makes the dumbest wish ever, man, I, I would rip her out of that fucking anime. Multiple slap her, man. She's already on track to becoming a magic girl. Don't say, I wish to become a magic girl. Forced to cry all alone. <laughs> but it is lonely, though. She wants a protege. Fight with me from now on.
okay by my side. It must be lonely. It's based on a wish, isn't it? She's stuck. You know what? She had no choice but to be a magic girl. So she needs someone com company, man. Because she's stuck like this. God, make your wish. It's like getting the robot Shinji. Make the wish, Madoka. Make the fucking wish. But none of that means anything if it's a boyfriend or a millionaire. She won't have time for that shit. And the cake. Cakey. <laughs> no, that's a waste of a wish. <laughs> I'm gonna become a magical girl for cake. Oh, oh, right there. It's hatching. Magic girl, transform. These these creatures look so harmless. They're like pictures of cakes, strawberries and cakes. Are the witch? Oh wow! Fuck it yeah. <laughs> up. She looks like she fucking is alive when she's fucking fine. Like rats and flies. Fought with such a happy feeling because she knows in it she'll have a project. Syringe. Chocolate flavor. <laughs> Chocolate flavor door. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Charlotte. Like bosses, man. Like personas. This is... Oh, God. Animation's like, kind of like for these... these. <clears throat> it's like it's like she's firing out of the head and the fucking flowers are coming out. I love the intentional use of uh, sanitized uh, violence. Oh, shit. Head of finale. Oh god, here we go. Oh. Does that mean she's dead? They only are oh. What's the wish? That's not necessary. Wow, she saved them from making the wish. I'll oh. What the hell? <laughs> look, look at the bemused face on the witch's face. Oh. The music is sick. Oh, crap. Where, where did the fucking explosions come from? She is fucking powerful, man. She did that effortlessly, man. Ah. So mommy sounds dead, man. That's fucked. She got fucking complacent, man.
she's giving them the chance to fucking make their mind up, man. Like, do you want to be a fucking magic girl? And they deserve that taste. They're back to mommy, sir. <laughs> oh shit. Savage. Their fucking sensei is fucking gone, man. Now, now, like, they have to decide now. See, that's a good life lesson for them, man. Alright, you know what? That's good, man. Yeah, it's, it started to fucking pick up, like. Like, what do you do? Like, why would you want to do this? I guess it asks. Why would you want to be a magic girl faced with the, you know, alternative? But then you get, you dream, the one wish. But what would that wish be to become, you know, to take on this fucking burden and responsibility? Let's we'll see where this goes, man. That was a good, good. I, I like the pacing. I like that this is only a 12 episode series. So I'll get through this, man. I'll be doing doubles now. I'll be doing doubles for this. Decent, decent start, man. Let's see where this goes. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. You feel for these characters. They're vulnerable enough. Like, they, they didn't just go from... They're still in that phase where they have to decide whether they want to be these badasses. But maybe being a badass ain't where it cut out to be, man. The fucking perils and danger. But imagine you go given a wish. What would your wish be? It makes you wonder, like, you forget all that fucking magic girl shit. Like, just the core concept of being given a wish... But to, you know, take the responsibility of protecting the world, killing witches, putting yourself in danger. Would you do that? Would I take a million dollars to become, I don't know, a soldier in the, in the army? Would I? No, nah, I wouldn't. I value my life too much. But then someone posed me with an even more difficult question. Like the dream, like Madoka's dream. Like she dreams about that shit. She wants to be a magic girl. But is it worth it? Even when you get the, a wish, your, your number one wish with it. It's interesting. Now she's got to see that taste. And I said that. I said that. Like, try it before you buy it, man. Like, she had to have seen what it's like to be a magic girl. Now she can make an informed decision. She had one badass chick going out shooting everything. Now she saw the same fucking badass chick. Fucking dead. Gone. So fucking, you know. Now she'll make an informed decision. And I think both of them will make an informed decision. So, be interested to see where this goes. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter for the latest live reaction updates. Those details in the description box below. Drifters live reaction in the description box below. Twitch details in the description box below. I stream video games. Dishonored 2. I'll be doing Final Fantasy 15. I will be doing Persona 5 next year. All that good stuff. Thank you very much for watching.